Hello, what's up again, YouTube? Thank you for tuning in to Katie Talk One On One. Make sure you hit that sub button, hit that notification bell, and most definitely stay tuned to the end because I'm coming to you with some news today that is coming from out of North Carolina, Fayetteville, North Carolina. And this is about a 27 year old mother of four who is charged with child abuse. Um, she's charged with child abuse because she left her four children home alone while she had to go to work. Okay, so but Venezia Sinclair, she ended up having to go to work and I'm guessing she did not have a, a babysitter to watch her children. So she just went on to work. And I said, luckily, there was a good person, a good Samaritan that ended up seeing her kids walking down um, the street from where they came from um, they were in, I believe, the, the area um, called Timber Lake. They were walking down Timber Lake Road, and a lady by the name of Tawana Robertson ended up spotting the children. So she ended up stopping them, and she was like, where are y'all going? And, and they said, we have not ate all day. We're on our way to our grandmother's house. And... You know, she she ended up, when they said they didn't eat, she told her dad to go and get them some chips and some snacks and things like that from the store. So I, I just said, you know, it is uh, by the grace of God that they did end up running into somebody with a good heart. And she ended up, you know, seeing something and she said something. But these four children, listen to their ages. These four children are ages three, five, six, and eight. So she went to work and she left her three-year-old, five-year-old, six and eight-year-old home alone. And, and it is so important when it comes to single parents, period, single moms or dads, for you to have a support system. Support systems are very important, especially when you're raising younger children. These are not ages where they are um, able to legally be at home by themselves. I don't know the young lady's situation, but it just sounds like an un unfortunate situation when you don't have that support system that you need when you're raising children out here because it's not easy. It's not easy when two people raising children and you know how hard it is raising children by yourself. It's even harder. So, yes, yeah, she was um, charged with uh, child abuse. She is out on bond. Um, the, the D it, it says they, uh, tried to, um, I think the police tried to get in contact with her and see if she had any kind of comments about the situation. They couldn't get in contact with her and, um, the, the child services, they're not able to release any information when it comes to this. So I will, um, I'll kind of stay up on this story and see in the future if I hear anything else back from this story, but it is really unfortunate when a parent don't have that real support that they need. The uh, village that raises the child, that whole mentality is out of there. And it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. And I'm just glad that the kids came out safe. And I'm glad that uh, Tawana Roberts, I'm glad that she did step in and call the police and do what she had to do. Got them something to eat. And make sure that they were safe and everything. So, you guys, make sure you drop down in that uh, description box because I will drop a link from the news. Um, from the news report, I think I have a little clip. Take a listen to this if I can get past the ad. Hold on, here go an ad. But here it go right here. Said she was driving down the street just after noon on Saturday when she noticed four small children walking carrying bags. Alarmed, she brought them inside this community center and called 911. And I started asking them questions like, where are your parents at? Where are you supposed to be at? And they said they were on the way to grandma's house. 
Robinson is a resident in the Hollywood Heights community. She agreed to talk with me, but didn't want to be on camera. Police say the children are ages three, five, six, and eight. They say the children were left home alone for hours while their mother was at work. Book bags, they had their coats on, they were ready to go somewhere. They were prepared. Their mother, 27-year-old Venasia Sinclair, is facing four counts of child abuse. Police say the children were found 10 minutes from home, walking on Timberlake Drive toward Pritchett. Robinson says the children told her they hadn't eaten all day and were hungry. So I actually had my dad go to the store and buy some chips and stuff. Robinson says another driver also spotted the children walking down the street, but she assured him she would take care of them. Tonight, she's thankful she found them before someone else did it was good that i called because we don't know where they could have been after the fact if i didn't do anything and the mother is out of jail tonight we tried to speak with her but got no answer at her home meantime it's still unclear whether or not the children were released back to their mother the ss says these matters are confidential i'm in Vanville, akila davis all right so that came from by way of akila davis from abc fair use so you guys, make sure you hit that sub button because I will be coming with more news stories and a little bit of celebrity gossip. So make sure you hit that sub button and stay tuned. And thank you for watching. And as usual, I love you, YouTube.